morning had it was couple soul show um <laughs> i really like this film and i felt this fun um alex um talk a little bit about what your thought process was going into this project please so uh lynn manuel first told me about this project in 2009 when we were still working on broadway on a show in the heights we were in performances and uh, over the years, the, the, uh, uh, the, sh the piece just evolved and got stronger and got better. Chiara Alegria Hudes became involved with the story, with the script. Uh, we brought on Juan de Marcos to voice the amazing character. Gloria Stefan said yes. You know, more and more, the, the show just evolved and became, uh, the, the movie, the musical evolved and became a really beautiful story. And I love seeing it change over time. I love seeing it become stronger and more powerful as, uh, as uh, drafts kept getting revised and, and the story became more focused. Um, and I love being able to bring what uh, I feel like I can bring to a project, which is not only my love of musical storytelling, but also my heritage. To be able to bring what it is that I, what little I know of Cuban music compared to a wonderful scholar like Juan de Marcos, to know that I feel like I can kind of intersect these worlds, to bring in a little bit of, of the Broadway world, to bring in a little bit of the pop world, to bring in a little bit of the, the Cuban music world. Uh, I, I was able to draw on all these things that make me me, and it was a joy to be able to bring that part of myself into this movie uh, in a way that I had not uh, a prior. So it, it's a, a really wonderful experience. Awesome. And Juan, you get to play this wonderful character. and. Talk a little bit what your approach, because he at first he's like, we have our routine, we have our lives, and then his whole trajectory changes. How much fun was it for you to just embody this this little bundle of joy? Yeah, well, for me, it was a pleasure because in certain sense, the story that's uh, written in the film, it's uh, in certain sense similar to my story. and. Uh, in this case, I'm the old guy that's helping the younger guy, but I used to be also, well, I was the young guy helped by uh, the old guys. And then in this case, uh, I'm the old guy helping the younger guy. And I have done it as well. I had the pleasure to work with the old guys to help them. And uh, this film is very related to my story, to my life. And the fact that it's dedicated to my country I've been for years fighting for my country. Try, you know, we've been in a country isolated for years because of political reasons. It was impossible to bring the Cuban music to the world. And I have been fighting during my whole life to bring this music, creating, writing music and presenting shows. And uh, the fact that this film is dedicated to Havana and it's so well represented Havana and the characters of the people, how the people behave, because this is the way that we behave. We are selling croquetas in the in the streets. We are singing in the streets. We are uh, playing domino in the streets. It was so well represented. It, it, it was a pleasure to work in this. It's, they have done a great work. Uh, Lin-Manuel Miranda wrote beautiful music. Alex Lacamoire wrote great arrangements the acting is great except mine because I, i'm not an actor at all but yeah. i had the upper <laughs> hand of all of these guys and i made it good enough for the layman <laughs> he was great he was great no no you did fantastic the film is heartfelt i think you're going to see a lot of kids and adults singing in the music thank you so much for your time and much success thank you Kathy. Cheers.